So, this is another Super Gas Sound 5 kitchen. And we're going to be making. We're going to turn our on and make fashion. No, the viewers want to know what we're making. We don't, don't know what we're making ourselves. So, it's a mystery dinner. Yeah. So, what we're, we're doing first? Cook some bully buff. Bully beef. And some fries. It says it right there. Wait. Sticky tag. Bully buff. It's corned beef. Yeah, but we're talking with the Jamaican slang. Bully buff and fried rice. I don't see no one else. So, what we're going to do now? What are we doing now? Right now, we're cutting up the seasoning. So we can season the pot. I don't know why my R's are watering right now. Onions are getting to it. Cut up some seasoning. Mm -hmm. Dice some seasoning. Make sure to cover it accurately. Do we have any garlic? Garlic. Wario's favorite food. That's what we are car cutting up. Garlic. No, wait, this is onions. Yeah. And why are we looking at the mystery food? We got. We're we supposed to know. This is our kitchen. It's gotta be in the fridge somewhere. And this is crab. But we're not making seafood. We'll make Chinese food later on. Scallion. Scallion. And can you explain to viewers what is a scallion? Scallion is a uh, natural seasoning. We're not going to use no artificial seasoning. We're going to use some natural seasoning. Okay then. Ooh, a tomato. Do we need this? Piece of sweet pepper. Sweet pepper does what to the food? Season it up. Does it add the spice? Yeah. Let's get to the cutting board. First, we have to wash our seasoning. We have to wash because we don't eat no germy food. No germy food. Pick off the dead leaf. All the dead leaf off it. These leaves are dead leaf. We don't want to eat that leaf in our food. Off the tip and unwrap it. Meantime, let's check the peppers. We got onion, green pepper, and sweet pepper. And there's our scallions. Spicy. Right now, the pot's just heating up. What do you know when the pot is hot? Open the pot. See the thing bubbling up in there? Put, or some, put some water in it and, and just flash it in it just a bit. So you can see it cinch. Right there you can see it's hot. That's the way we need the pot to be hot. Be hot. Right here. Mm. Cut up the scallions. Dice up our seasoning. We just wait that for that to season up. Because we need our spice or food, don't need no spare food. You can smell the seasoning in the pot. Ah, oh, it smells like home cooking. So while the vegetables are setting, let's get our other vegetables out. We got a frying pot. Frying pot? Yeah. Frying pot to cook the rice in. This, this pot is too small. 
That's a Chinese pot. Mm. We don't need the green pot. It's some fried rice. So, then we wash it with the pot. So we get all the spaces underneath. We don't need any germs sneaking up on us, especially in our food. Hey, hey, no cursing on the kids' show. This, this it cannot work? Yes, it can. Go in the back. Get me it's a fork back. and turn the seat in the other part. A fork. A fork. Where's a fork? Oh. Ha ha ha. And turn the seat in. Turn the motor. Okay. okay. Remember, you want them to be fully submerged. Swirl it on. Ah, the sound of suffering. The sound of suffering. Mmm, smells like heaven. The knife. Mm, now we cut up our green pepper. And make sure, kids, if you want to do this, get parents' advice. Get the parents to be with you. Yeah, advice and be with you. That's what it is. Because you can't, you can't cook this. You say kids can't cook? No, kids can't cook right now. But they don't know what they're doing. I can smell the spice on that too. So now let's just mix up our cell our onions, our yeah. scallions and green peppers and let's throw them in the pot. Yeah. Yeah, because uh, us as Super Gats Sound 5, we make our own dishes. We don't go to anybody else's dishes. We make our own food. Because that's how we are. Have you heard the old saying? Turn your hand to make fashion. Turn your hand to make fashion. Yeah, turn your hand to make fashion. Oh, got an onion. So, what else would we need? Hmm. Tomato? I didn't even know we have hey, hey, no curse on the kids show. That's a sin. Let me get PG-15. Now I'm about to add the world's most common vegetable. A tomato. Ooh, Ooh look at the steam. Dice up, dice up. Dice up so it can come out dicey. Look at this. Look at the smoke coming off of it. Some hot tomato. Yeah, let's add that vegetable. Here. Let's close up so the heat can cook it faster. So there's the end for the tomato. Got it. I didn't watch the video. Yeah, just put it on. Just run about. Do 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 Make sure to have your utensils all washed off before you use them. Because you know, you can have dirty utensils to wash. 
Ah, you know? The Chinese pie is ready. Got it. Here. One at a time, though. Sure, with the rice. <laughs> Ooh, that was hot. Oh, my feet. Feet red. Using Dale rice. What is this? That's the rice from yesterday. The Chinese rice or the, or the, or the Oxygen rice? The Jamaican rice or the Chinese rice? There's a complete difference from them. Chinese rice are yellow, Jamaican rice are paled. Well, sometimes Jamaican rice is yellow because the curry. Yeah. So let's forget about that. So let's add some browning. Browning. Green. Another green. Something that will last for. Something hot. hot, 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 hot. <laughs> so turn on that. It's not that high enough. So we're adding some olive oil. Just a bit of olive oil. Olive oil. And a concoction of a bit of A1 sauce. That's the original sauce. Ooh. Oh, God. I cook like a Chinese person. Shake it up. Shake it. Just shake it. Shake it. Shake some bait. Who knew? Who knew olive oil and uh, bacon sauce could have a horrible reaction to that? We're using the rice? Uh, these, at least rice can do it. And we use the fork again to scoop it up. And look at that. Now let's let that rice settle. And now let's go to the corned beef. Remember, use the key for the corned beef. Or else you can't open it. What's your booty box? Wait, what? That's how you open it? That's how you open bully pop? Mm -hmm. I like you open it from the top. You don't like rip it all the way from the bottom, like ripping someone's abdominal place off. Why do you think you could have a key? That's the purpose of the key. Yes, and let's put our bully pop in there. Look at that. Now, in a while, the bully pop will separate from its form. The bully pop, uh, and make corn beef. Now separating the rice from its original shape. And it's already um twelve minutes in the video, gosh. Anyway, explain to me why we're adding browning to the rice. Let's change the color. Why? According to browning, it's only used for cakes and Fruit cakes. Only use for cakes, only. No, 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 no. Add rice. Sir. Your mother needs them. My mother. Oh, fine. First, I thought the myth was a um, myth was true, but no. You can add rice. You can add rice, Chinese rice, to American rice. I don't dislike it saying I'm racist, I'm not racist. Just saying. So you call the butter for me. Oh the butter. Hmm. So much stuff in this picture. Be like amazed find this butter. I need Pac-Man for this. Oh wait. Oh here the butter. Oh, oh god. Things headed off a ledge. Hold on. It's my super sick feet. Wait, hold on, people you gotta take this this reason down. Where you see a black pepper at? Up top. You mean the red one? No. Oh, sorry guys for that disturbance. Something dropped. Okay, now we're using butter to flavor the rice. And now right here, we see our corned beef has separated from the shape. Now it's looking like meatballs. And tuna combined too, because it kind of looks like it. And right with that setting, our rice is mixing with the butter so it can add flavor. 
So like two dishes combined to one. So at this time, I should really be talking to Charles right now, but... Oh, Game Universe 2, if you say it. But right now, we got some better things to do than that. So you trolls are stopping. Look at that rice. Look how delicious it looks. And now since we're finished mixing the butter together, now the seasoning is black pepper. black pepper. We got everything in this house. There is pep our peppers and onions and scallions are mixing together. And now we're adding some pepper. Black pepper is that's working. This is working. You got pat from the top. Yes, you can see on it then. And it's mixing with the tomato sauce. So now our regular corned beef is turning to the traditional bully bop that we all eat. And if you don't know bully bop, I'm feel sorry for you. But I already told you. That rice is looking good. How is it? Mm -hmm. How about wait? Hold on. Should we eat beef at this time? Because right now you don't know if it's undercooked. And you know, don't undercook your beef because you have terrible stomach troubles for that. There's consequence to that, people. So if you don't undercook this meat, don't do it. Don't. Now we're adding. Pure olive oil to our bully beef, not bully bop. So it doesn't stick on the bottom? So let's stick there, we're just making it like slippery, slippery dippery. You don't want it to stick on the bottom. And we're adding hot sauce, yeah, hot sauce, let's add more, more. Yeah, hot sauce. We get that south the border taste in there. Alright, we're supposed to see already know. Yes, let's just mix up our bully bop. Some more black pepper in there, bro. Where's the black pepper? Hmm. Oh. We can use the pick of pepper. Black pepper. To make in. What was that? Pick of pepper. Black pepper. Wait, hold on. I need to show the viewers about what pick of pepper is. Pick of pepper is like Jamaican version of barbecue sauce. That's what it is. Yeah. yeah. Jamaican barbecue sauce. Even has right here. Look. Yeah, when we don't have no gravy, we need that. Yeah, so that's pick a pepper. Should we be adding that to the rice right now? Um, pick a pepper to the rice. You want to change the color? No, we don't. I thought brown changes the color. Now you say pick a pepper change the color? But pick a pepper black. So, you must change the color. So, you want to keep it caramel, not black. No, we don't want it black. We're not being racist. Mmm. That rice looks good. Any, I even like Fried rice. rice. It looks good. Fried rice. Fried rice. Look at our traditional Japanese pan and a regular American pot. Some cold American rice. Now let's get a plate. Hmm. Oh boy. Like yeah. the world's worst hazard right here. Huh? Three little bowls. Where? Dim type. I two of them left? Yeah, there's two of them. Tina, one two of them. How much do you got there were? I thought you were going that. Yeah, that's what I thought. That there's three. Like one for you, one for me, one for Mark. Mark. It's just my name, Mark. What? 
Hmm, there we go. Our two plates are ready. Well, we got finished cooking. Got finished cooking. I'm just speaking in my man voice. How's it taste? Mm, can't wait to dig my mouth into that. Like, rah, 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 rah. Now, put back the butter. Yeah, let's put this curry in all the way in the back. Let's put that over there. And there ends the refrigerator. Oh. Yeah. Look at this. Uh, Cappuccino, coffee, mocha, decaf, decaf, and latte. Yeah, coffee and stuff. No bomber, man. No bomber stuff. Yep. But. My giant fork and my giant spoon. Right now, here's my super spot. Okay, let's add the rice slowly and carefully. But who spoils that? I thought that was my bowl. So, yeah. And now, who spoils this? Actually, they're same bowls right now. Okay, that's enough. That's not yours. You could say that's your bowl. No. I thought you that you might have. So. You want to one? What's the next bowl? So whose bowl was this? You said this was that bowl. Whoa. Let's hit that. No dumplings. No, no dumplings this time. Not like shadows dumplings. We're not doing that one. We just simple rice. Simple. No dumplings. What we got. So probably in the future we do more of the uh, Super Galaxy on 5 kitchen. Sorry for all the wedding stuff because well me and my dad well not dad. Me and my helper right here. We haven't come up with a bunch of other other ingredients or recipes that we can make on our own. So we just pop up anything that is in our minds and say, yes, this is our food that we're gonna make. So what do you think the future is, the future food is going to be? Mm -hmm. The future ones, like the ones we're going to do in the future, like 2015 or such. Well, we just turn on and make fashion, so anything we're left, we use. Yes. We don't have no specialized. It's like one man's trash is another man's treasure. Only that, this guy's trash is treasure, like it's gold that he drew out. So it's like a rich guy threw his gold out, and we took it, and then made it into our gold. Yeah. Yeah, something like that. I'm definitely going to take a selfie with this. Yeah. So now we're just adding up our pots in there until we wash them. So this is our mystery dinner. Mm, that looks delicious. Damn. Even though I don't even eat rice that much, the rice is a little delicious. And with butter too, man. This is fried rice. Fried rice. Oh gosh, here comes the best bowl ever. Look at that. Mm. So this is scruff. I'm going to be in the event guys all soon. So, see you. See you later. Big bump.